Modifying properties of the lighting fixture. We can modify properties of the lighting fixture either before or after we insert them into our project. If we've inserted it into our project, such as this floor lamp, I can select it. I can go to modify and select the floor lamp and it'll show up in my properties instance. In here I can determine which level it's on. Uh, I can also have some electrical data if you're using the electrical, mechanical, and plumbing sections of Revit where it'll calculate all the loads for you. I can put which phasing it's in, you know, for new construction, etc. So I can change those types of things if needed. I can also go to edit the type. Now this is going to edit it for the entire type of floor lamp and the entire project, not just this one instance. So I might want to make a duplicate and put a, say, you know, a living room behind uh, uh, stuff over stuffed chairs or something like that if I want to just have, you know, a subset of these things. But I can come over to the value and I can control the materials uh, and the finishes of of the uh, of the particular lamp if I need to. I can also change some of the electrical uh, information uh, that I need. Um, and I really want to go down to uh, uh, electrical. Let's scroll down here. Uh, dimensions. We have uh, the dimensions at this point, but really the, the the main area down here is this photometrics here. Here we have the tilt angle, the spot beam. Uh, you know, like a spotlight uh, has a, a hot spot and a, a larger spot. But initial attempts. Uh, let's go with uh, this one right here. The light loss. You know, how much does the light fall off as you get further away from the light is one area you can uh, change considerably. Uh, next area is its initial intensity. Now, the initial intensity is really important to how bright things are. Uh, so, in this case, we can just pick the wadge of light bulb, which is pretty simplified in reality. but we can actually kick this up, uh, you know, and change it to a different light bulb. But we do already have types for that, actually, in this particular style. Um, but we also have the color, the initial color of the light. And this is in Kelvins. Uh, so we think of a color of a light is from cool to warm. Cools are in the blue colors. Warms are up in the orange and yellows. Um, and... Uh, so here we have the temperature, uh, we have some presets like halogen, so we have the different types of lights and you can see the effect by changing on a halogen light versus a low sodium of what the colors will do uh, to it. You know, some have a more orangish reddish color and some have more bluish uh, color and style. Um, you can uh, also have a color filter, like putting a piece of uh, colored plastic or lens over the light that give it a different shade if you like so if you want to have a red you know shade to it or a purple shade you can put a filter over it so a lot of these will control the look and feel of a lighting fixture to to a great deal